Hey everyone, it's Erin here in Com not Comox, I'm in uh, Ottawa, Ontario, just getting ready for my competition in two days. And as I'm preparing for this, I was thinking of you guys because I'm doing something out of my comfort zone and thinking that many of you are stepping out of your comfort zone today. You've probably just finished two cleanse days, so congratulations, that's quite an accomplishment. I remember doing that it was a very big feat for me. It was the longest I'd ever gone without having meals. And so pat yourself on the back. Doing two cleanse days is a very big deal. And it was actually the beginning of a whole new life for me of eating clean and realizing that I didn't need all these extra things. I didn't need all that extra food. It was just weighing me down. In fact, what I learned that by eating clean and giving my body the best I actually felt amazing. I woke up and I felt fantastic. And I've been reading the comments, um, especially, you know, there was one uh, Tana's father saying that he was on top of the world driving and singing and he wanted to break into a run while he was walking. That just made my night. Reading those posts are fantastic. So I'm um, really excited about your progress, really proud of you all of you for engaging and posting and, and staying the game. Well, here's a tip for you. Um, and this has to do with food and food prep because I just finished preparing. If I could open my fridge and show you, I would. But I've just finished preparing 36 meals for Jodine and I. We've been preparing together um, for our fitness show. So we have to eat six times a day, all day Friday and all day Saturday. So this is something I would never would have done in the past. Well, obviously I wasn't needing to, but just for everyday life, I'm walking away from this going, wow, what a difference when you plan and prepare your meals. So here's a tip I'm gonna give you guys. Plan and prepare your meals the night before, or even if you know it's a whole weekend, plan ahead and treat yourself to some awesome Tupperware. Go to the store, splurge a little bit, get yourself some really nice stackable Tupperware that you can put in your fridge, and then do a cooking day. Do a day where, I mean, you're going to have your isogenics fuel, so two to three of your meals are going to be taken care of. But for those other meals, plan ahead. You can even prepare all your, like, oatmeal ahead of time. Um, boil up a whole bunch of eggs so they're handy. I just cooked a whole tray of chicken breasts today, a whole tray of white fish, and I've learned I love mahi-mahi. If you're a shopper at Costco, go there and they have these little mahi-mahi steaks and Ziploc. Um, you just take one out and about an hour later it's thawed, fried up and delicious and even cold. I don't know why it actually tastes pretty good cold. Um, cooking up your vegetables. Then like I said, buy yourself one of those awesome set of um, Tupperwares. Get yourself a great little traveling cooler. I just saw a mini cooler on wheels. I kind of wish that I'd bought it. Um, and now I'm set. So tomorrow I get to spend the whole day with my kids downtown Ottawa, our nation's capital, with my sister and my friend Jodine. We're going to tour around the parliament buildings. We're going to shop till we drop. And I have all my food ready and I can stay 100% one day out from a fitness competition and be fully prepared. So planning and preparing. If you have not done that, <clears throat> I highly recommend that you do, especially with the weekend coming. Get your vegetables cut up, get your salads ready, get your oatmeal cooked, your eggs cooked, get yourself some Tupperware, clean out your fridge, have your own shelf, get it all organized, and label it if you want. You're going to feel like a million bucks. You deserve it. So have a great night, guys. And for those of you who only did one cleanse day, I'm really proud of you too. One cleanse day is a great accomplishment. Two days is awesome. And don't forget to get your water in. Have a good night. Take care.